a device capable of detecting and deciphering brain signals may be able to give the gift of speech back to people who have lost the ability due to muscular paralysis or nerve damage. Electrodes fitted in the human brain pick up on what a person wants to say and transforms it into a digital signal which is then spoken by a voice synthesizer. It was tested on five volunteers who have electrodes already in their brain as a treatment for epilepsy and the machine was able to speak 150 words per minute. This, the developers claim, is much faster than existing technology and equivalent to a normal conversation. The technology is reliant on brain signals designed to move parts of the face and throat involved in speech, such as movements of the eye, ah, larynx, lips and tongue. It was found that although they are very complex they are also similar in most people. Natural speech production involves more than 100 facial muscles, according to the scientists from the University of California. The technology includes giving people the ability to talk again as long as they are able to imagine mouthing the words. Signals from the brain are fed into a neural network computer linked to a voice synthesizer, similar to that used by the late Stephen Hawking, but far quicker. The famed academic, who suffered with motor neuron disease for most of his adult life, was only able to speak around 10 words a minute. This was produced using his cheek to select the words and was a relatively slow process, despite being the best technology available at the time.